Hello YouTubers, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you a video on how I'm converting the Y axis for the TM25 uh, milling machine uh, into CNC control. It's a um, ball screw conversion, it has a mounting plate and a standoff plate, uh, also with a NEMA uh, 23 I believe it is as well. You have access underneath to um, put the coupling in and tighten it up, put your nut on the, the ball screw. Um, I design my own mounts and uh, machine out my own bearings and everything like that. I'll show you the other shot here. So here's the mount plate and the standoff plate. So to do this today with uh, with HSM, I'll be doing uh, heaps of basic 2D sort of stuff, profiling, adaptive clearing, drilling. I'll also be doing some um, uh, drilling and tapping cycles. So what's a good thing with HSM, if I'll show you here on the Haas Super Mini Mill, you can see I've got a, a fair few number of tools. Uh, the tool changer in the Haas will be tw uh, tw 24 plus 1 in the spindle. Um, I don't have all those tools. We've got a fair few in there though. And in HSM, you can put all this in your database, in your library, and uh, so your machine can use it. So I've created my own folder in there, and I've got all my tools with all the different offsets and you know, tell it to run what, what is it carbide, you know, the chip per and all that sort of stuff and just makes life so much easier. Uh, I'd have to say this HSM, I'm, I'm loving it, you know, more and more each time I use it. So yeah, thanks fellas at CAD Pro, you, I owe you a big time. Alrighty, well let's get into it. Okay guys, I've um, machined one side. I have to flip it now in the vise and reset the G54 to, this to the centre of this circle. Then I need to machine out that and, and rigid tap it so it looks something like that. What I'm going to do now is uh, place the part in the mill this way and I'm going to do some, um, a bit of facing, adaptive clearing and a clean up pass.
Well, there we have it, fellas. There's the uh, finished Y-axis uh, components. I'm quite happy with the overall finish of it. The engraving as well. This is the stepper motor side, this side here. So I'll assemble, assemble it now and you can see how it all goes together. Okie dokie, there we have it. There we have it. All finished, all engraved, looking schmicko. Uh, quite happy with it.